Meghan Markle has faced scrutiny in the press this week after five of her friends gave an interview in a US magazine last week to tell the truth about the Duchess of Sussex. An explosive letter Meghan sent to her father, three months after Mr Markle pulled out of the Duchess's wedding, was also revealed last week. Speaking on Sky News is the pledge, panelist Carol Malone claimed the treatment Meghan has faced is nothing like Diana. Ms Malone also claimed that if Meghan continues playing the victim, it will force the royal palace and the British public to turn on her. She said, last week, five of Meghan Markle's closest friends spoke to People magazine to vilify the Duchess's father. They told the world she is being traumatized and bullied, and none of the criticism of her is justified because she is perfect and wonderful. I'm sorry, I just don't buy that any true friend would have spoken without Meghan's explicit permission. They were doing exactly what Meghan had begged her dad not to do, to speak about her in the media. Which then reignited the row with her dad and spawned a whole slew of sensational news stories. Now George Clooney has weighed in claiming Meghan's being chazzed just like Diana was, but who exactly is chazzing and bullying and traumatizing her? Not her family, who she has had no contact with and who have been silent for months. Dot she added, as for the few scraps of criticism in the media, that's nothing like what happened to Diana. Meghan won't get the public admiration she craves by playing the victim and trying to manipulate the press coverage of her. She knows the family motto, never complain, never explain, and if she thinks she can change that by getting her friends to tell the world how wrong, yet how wonderful she is, the palace and the public will turn on her. Last week five of Meghan's friends decided to defend the Duchess of Sussex in an anonymous interview with US magazine People. One of Meghan's inner circle said, Meg has silently sat back and endured the lies and untruths, we worry about what this is doing to her and the baby. It's wrong to put anyone under this level of emotional trauma, let alone when they're pregnant. Dot although, royal experts have warned the Duchess of Sussex with her friends speaking out in the media to defend her. Camilla Tomini told Today, although it is not unprecedented for royals to brief the press via friends, Diana and Charles did it all the time when their marriage was breaking down. It's not necessarily recommended. It just opens the floodgates. The more you give bad publicity, the oxygen of publicity, it just gets worse and worse. It comes following the release of a handwritten note Meghan sent to her father last August. The note was sent just three months after Mr. Markle had pulled out of his daughter's wedding due to health concerns, which following a row over staging paparazzi photographs. Part of the letter reads, your actions have broken my heart into a million pieces, 